term liquidity facility of rupees 50000 crore to ease access to emergency health services to boost provision of immediate liquidity for ramping up covid related healthcare infrastructure and services in the country and on tap liquidity window of rupees 50000 crores 50 rupees 50000 crore with tenor of up to 3 years at the repo rate is being opened till march 31st 2022 that is march 31st of next year under the scheme banks can provide fresh lending support to a wide ranging of entities including vaccine manufacturers importers and suppliers of vaccine and priority medical devices hospitals and dispensaries pathology labs manufacturers and suppliers of oxygen and ventilators importers of vaccine and covid related drugs logistics firms and also patients for treatment banks are being incentivized for quick delivery of credit under the scheme through extension of priority sector classification to such lending and this facility will be available up to 31st march next year that is that is 31st march of 2022 these loans will continue to be classified under priority sector till repayment or maturity whichever is earlier banks may deliver these loans to borrowers directly or through intermediary financial entities regulated by the reserve bank of india banks are expected to create a covid loan book under the scheme by way of an additional incentive such banks will be eligible to park their surplus liquidity up to the size of covid loan book with the rbi under the reverse repo window at a rate which is 25 basis points lower than the repo rate or termed in a different way that is explained in a different way 40 basis points higher than the reverse repo rate so this is an additional incentive that is being given to the extent that they are you using this window and they are lending and to the extent that is available in their covid loan book which they are going to create whatever is the loan disbursed under that window equivalent amount they can put it in reverse repo at a rate which is 40 bips higher than the normal reverse repo rate which prevails today